Hello everybody, it's me, your good friend Sparky, and welcome back to Mega Man Battle Network. I decided to head back in the other direction for a little bit, just to explore around a little more, because I feel like I probably missed some mystery data or something somewhere. Like this. 800 zennies, that's a very helpful something. Anything else? I don't think so, but we'll check around quick anyway. We are still in the school network, trying to... Uh, get the uh, World 3 re-education program from uh, Stop Doing Its Nefarious Goings On. And, ow. That interrupted my sword chip, and I am very upset at that. I'm getting shot in the face a few times. I'm very upset at this. Huh. Maybe this sword chip will work a little better. Hassan Chop. Okay, all right. You guys want to go? You guys want to go? Huh? Hmm? Hmm? Stupid little viruses hopping around like some kind of dummies. They're not really hopping. There's no hopping involved. I don't know why I said hopping. Uh, but uh, it is important to try and gather lots of very strong battle chips because you eventually get to points like this where you have very powerful enemies with a lot of HP. Collecting chips is very important. And hey, we got to see Roll actually heal us. That's cool. Eventually, we'll have lots of strong things, of course. But for right now, we're still on the kind of offensively light side of things. And no, that was just that mystery data this way. Okay. Oh, hi. You're spooky. Uh, I don't really have anything to take care of you very quickly. Maybe we can trick you into... Running into the shockwave. Nope. Sometimes that works. Oh well. You want to make sure that you have room to dodge up or down when dealing with these guys, because otherwise they can trap you. Oh, come on, really? I mean, it is, like, just a grid you're going along, so there should always technically be room to dodge up or down. But you don't want to, like, back yourself up into a corner too quickly. Okay, bang. Yeah, just, just, that's, that's enough out of you, I think. Oh, hey, we got an invis chip. Invisibility in Battle Network is actually invincibility. So if we use the invince chip, we won't take damage for a little while. I might actually put that in my folder in a little bit. Uh, just to say we did. Ah, eh, more of these guys. I think a couple shockwaves should do the job. Oh, you hopped. How dare you. The good news about, uh, Flappies is that they do stop in place for a good amount of time. And when you're right up close to an enemy, you can use your, uh, Mega Buster much faster. Like that. Whoops! I moved a little too far down. Well, that works. Anyway, time to get back to where we were and uh, continue exploring the school network uh, before we are re-educated by the World 3. But honestly, I feel like the World 3 might do a better job of educating us than the school was doing. Because, you know, that kid who like couldn't remember chip codes, which were just, uh, you know, the alphabet. It really says a lot about your education system when the alphabet becomes difficult, honestly. But... Who am I to judge, really? Ow, you and your hopping. I don't appreciate you hopping so much. I'm going to rapid fire in your face lots and lots of times. Ah, the, yeah, with the hopping and stuff. Jeez. Hopping madness. I'm hopping mad. <laughs> All right, uh, let's keep going, let's see what's going on. I control the library book loan data, but I have been badly damaged by the World 3. Please repair the damage to the network. We shall, little program. 
by first opening another gate with another passcode. Number of volumes of History of the World. Plan. So I need to find out how many volumes of History of the World there are, right? Okay, be right back. Call me with L when you find out. And Aid, we need to rush... Yeah, I get out of the way. <laughs> we need to rush out of the classroom and off to the library or something of the sort. Hi, what's up? We can't get to the first floor. All those other poor children being re-educated. Hi. No blackboard here, but the speech program is on the PC. Okay. Ah, uh, let's see. Do you not know the school is under lockdown right now? Encyclopedias are lined up on the shelf. There are 30 volumes of History of the World here. Cool. Let's uh, check out these other vol- The, uh... Do they all say the same thing? I guess they do. Anything else cool? Anything? Cool, cool battleships or anything here? That'd be cool. If I had cool battleships. Hi. It's a good time to take one's mind off of things by reading a good book. Again, school's in lockdown. Things are... Things, things couldn't be worse. But... You know, I guess... Oh, hey, we found an escape age. Cool. It's, it's good to always just poke around on random things. Anyway, we've got a school to save. Since nobody else seems to care. Passcode is 30 volumes of History of the World. And back to Mega Man's side of things. Where we will continue to run this way. And fight more viruses. Oh dear. Well. This solves all our problems. Again, it's a little cheesy, but you know what? It's fun. It's cool. It makes things it makes things fun. And we get money! Yay. I actually prefer more battle chips. This door is passcode protected. Door will not open without proper autorization. Passcode hit. None. What? No hint. Let's just try anything. Ah, uh, well. I guess they kind of gave up on their uh, little gimmick of having Lan check things out around the school and just decided to make it random. Because that's what this is. We put in a number. And then... The, uh... Door will... Tell us if we got it right or wrong. If we do it too many times and get it wrong in a row, we have to uh, reset it and try again. Let's go too high, second digit verification failure. So what that means is that we got the first digit of the passcode right. It will tell you if it's too high, too low, if one or the other digit is wrong. So the first one is seven. We'll try three. Too high, okay. Let's try two. Nope. Uh, we know zero is wrong, so it must be 71. There we go. Way to go. Neat. Though it's not a very uh, secure network, I don't think, where you can open up everything by just guessing random numbers, and eventually you'll get in. <laughs> Normally, you can get to the teacher's lounge just by going up and to the right, and now there are several breaks in the network. Much like everywhere else, I guess. Uh, let's see. We'll see if we can get both of you with this. Ah, we got shot. That's unfortunate. Did not time that out right. Oh, well. Mm -hmm. Whoops, Kerblamo and Kerblui. It's okay, we defeated you, so we did not get caught in the violent explosion. But we did get these any. Okay, down this way. Up and around. Hello, more doors. What's down here first though? Another door. So many doors to choose from. Hi. Door will not open without proper authorization. Number of doors in this school. Okay. Please go check. Uh, let's see. Well, we can only really get to so many parts of the school, I think. We've got one. Hi. We can go downstairs now. Okay. Uh, two, three, four, five, 
six here. Gotcha. Well, we can go downstairs. So. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Okay. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. I think the double doors only count as one, so the answer would be 15. Let's try it. Dots? Cool, it worked. Neato burrito. More people should use the phrase neato burrito. Uh, da da da. This seems like a way forward, though. I don't know if I like that. I want to see if I can find other things first. Um, let's use this. See if we can catch a couple of you. Well, that didn't really work out. I was kind of hoping the Flappy would jump uh, elsewhere. But, you know, whatever. We can catch you both with bees. Or at least, we could if you would cooperate. Hmm. Ah. Oh well, whatever. This solves our problems. Bang. Bang. Away you go. Honestly, battles can get pretty hectic pretty quickly in this game. If you're not ready for them. Spreader H. Very nice. Just because when you get to the battles where there's lots of different kinds of enemies, uh, yeah, it can, it can be a thing. Uh, go get him, Roll. Who are you gonna get? I guess you're attacking that cannon. I forget if Roll has any kind of preference to, uh, what enemy she targets. I know she'll typically target the closest enemy, but not, uh, how she determines that if she's on a specific, like, if, if they're both on the same column or something like that. Ow. Go away. It's okay. Consequences in Mega Man Battle Network 1 for taking damage are very minimal, unless you're in a boss fight. Ah, uh, let's see. Hi, how are you? Uh, da da da. We'll use bombs. Use bombs wisely, as they say. And we can just kinda chill out here and try and, you know shoot this guy a few dozen times. There we go. Very cool. Uh, let's see what's past this other door, though. Door only put in uh, authorization, passcode hint none. So time for more random guessing. 50. Too low. Uh, 75. Too low. 88? Still too low. Dang. Whoops. Uh, I don't know if that just reset it. <laughs> uh, we'll try 90. Just, just go all the way. 99. Too high. Uh, 93. Too high. I think that reset everything, unfortunately. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, let's, let's try, let's just try again. Because that wasn't making any sense. 50? Too high. Okay, yeah, every time you go in and out, it resets it, apparently. I backed out completely on accident. Seven, 25. Too low. Alright. 30. 7. Too low. So it's in the 40s, it would seem. 44. Too low. Second digit verification failure. Okay. Too low. It's not 5. It's not 7. 6. Too low. Uh, 8. Yay, 48. The magic number, apparently. Hi. Did you know can you jack into any blackboard? I see. 
Mystery data. HP memory. Cool. We have more health now. That was a very helpful uh, thing to find. Protected by a passcode. Now, uh, let's see. Actually, we'll use these swords. Got you. Got you. And in just a moment, we will have you. Very good. Ah, uh, I would I would definitely like more battle chips, but I'm getting lots of Zenny, so I guess that's good for buying battle chips in certain spots. Ah, uh, da dum. I'll take care of you quick enough. And cut your HP down by half. Hanging out in the back when fighting the bomb guys is pretty uh, useful because their attacks have a lot of hang time. So it's easier to dodge when you're in the back and you move forward, I think. Though as those enemies type of enemies get tougher, it does get tougher to avoid the explosions. So you have to change up your strategies a little bit. Hi. If you're going towards the A room, B room, be very careful. The network is very unstable. Good to know. Ah, uh, let's see, let's see. Lots of flappies. Kind of annoying, honestly. <laughs> Probably should have more effectively used that. We can trick the flappies to trying to attack over a hole. That's an awkward spot. Which does break the panel. And, uh, yeah. Actually, shouldn't the panel have broken when I moved off of it? I don't know why it didn't. Oh well. Oh dear. Yeah, that's weird. Oh well. And we did go another quake chip. The quake chips act a little like bomb chips where they go in an arc. And they're rather slow to act. So they're not always the most helpful. Explode everything. Let's do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. Very nice. That's an S if I've ever seen one. Invis 1J. Gotcha. Ah, Lan! Everything's getting zappy. Sorry, I'm stuck in a trap. I can't move. Where are you? Near the AV room. Sorry. Don't worry, I'll check it out. Oh no, Mega Man's in trouble. We need to go save him. We need to find wherever the heck the AV room is. Is that upstairs? I forget. That's the library. No? Uh, AV room, AV room. It's, the, it's okay, Mega Man. Maybe the AV room's this way. Maybe. Uh, hi. No, oh, that's locked. AV room? Ah, yes, that one's the AV room. What's going on? Mr. Hicksby does not seem to be very concerned over this. Not suspicious in the slightest. Uh, let's see. Something here is trapping our Mega Man friend. We need to figure out exactly what. The computer's memory is full, and so it is frozen up. Do you want to restart it? Sure. The computer is fixed. Land, thanks. Told you I'd get to you out. How very helpful of you, Lan, my friend. And Land will continue to be very helpful next time. We are going to finish up this here network problem that we're having in the school and the next episode of Mega Man Battle Network. So until then, thank you very much for watching. This is your good friend Sparky, signing off for now. I'll catch you later. I wonder if the fact that Mr. Higsby walked out of this room is suspicious in, in any way, shape, or form.
Nah, probably not. <laughs>